What's going on guys, Mech Arena Central here, welcome back to another mech video. So guys, as you know, we now have dashes in the game, it only works going forwards. So, as a result of this, it's generally suited to mobile phones and tablets. I just wanted to do an update video on how to modify your emulator so that you can use the dash. Now this isn't an ideal fix, but it's a workaround. So. All you do guys is you go to your control editor in Blue Snacks. I'm not sure how it would work in Nox or, or, or um, one of the other emulators. And then you just drag your size of your WASD wheel, I want to call it. You just drag the size of that up to being quite big. So I'll cancel this because I already have it set to work. Okay. Um, now guys, another thing that's pretty cool for us YouTubers, the devs actually listen to my suggestion. We can now modify each of these individually, which is really nice to have. So I can leave the SFX on. You may just try that and I'll do a few rounds. They still haven't fixed the in-game chat. Now, I, a lot of people are saying they want to remove it. I don't think they should remove it. I think they should keep the chat. It's a step forwards, but as you can hear, the sound's working now. This is an absolute scam, so anyone that goes to this website and tries to do this, please don't be fooled. It's just, it's just a scam. They just want to steal your account. That's all they're after. Probably to make some sort of account selling website or something in the future. So guys, now we're going to go into the game. This is all fixed. I'm going to test out the... Yeah, we're going with Bricklayer here. We're going to test out the, the dash ability on the emulator here. And this video is designed as a companion piece to my original How to Play Mech Arena on your PC video, so I will link that in the description. Make sure to check that out, as I'm sure a lot of people are going to be saying, well, hey, hold on a minute, you've titled the video this way, and you didn't show how to actually play on your PC. So that will be in the description, guys. Ooh, I should turn that down. And how did we just get 3,000 bots on a, a day three heat? That's unusual. I'm really sure to turn that down. All right, guys, so as I was saying, um, if you're playing on tablets, then you may want to just go into customize controls and actually minimize the size of the wheel just to work with the dash because I've heard that a lot of people have problems getting it to work especially as you have to drag it to the top of the screen so let's test out the dash now see as you can see mine is activating here which which is highlighted by this key oh bit of a bit of a froggy throat <laughs> yeah so Basically, that's the workaround. Until they add like a button you can use, you can't assign it to a key. It would just auto activate and then burn out. And man, these bots are really, really annoying. All right, let's focus. Skip that cheater poop. I'm not sure why they put us against bots like this already, but anyway. Oh no you don't Zephyr. Ooh, a lot of cheaters on here. 36 seconds, come on. I'm dead. Ugh. Yeah, that's really unlucky odds just to be, be put against enemies this level. What? 
What is with this? Thing is, I'm under leveled for um, a lot of my bots. Okay, we lost round number one. It's time to focus, get the win. Be a loss, guys. Oh, missed. This is my first game of the day. What a way to launch me into the game, guys, chucking me against 3,200 bots. Especially only on a, on a day three heat, that is ridiculous. And they're all Zephyrs, Cheaters, and Aries. I mean, couldn't even, couldn't have even picked the worst combination of bots to go against. So, pulling out all the stops now. We're going to get the win here. Strong bots. Six star, no doubt. Six star max, by the looks of things. Get some of that dash going on. Oh! I'm dead. Yeah, no way I'm surviving that. And the bot's actually doing better than I am. <laughs> okay. Let's try and get a couple of kills in here, guys. We already got the lead, so it's a nice assured win. Oh, I'm in my juggernaut. Whoopsie. I didn't want this one yet. Just everything that could be going wrong is going wrong right now. Wow. Outdone by a bot. And we went to maintenance straight afterwards. <laughs> no words for what just happened. I think I think that's it. Yeah. Alright guys, well I'm gonna call this footage here and see you in the next video, I assume, if this one has anything else tacked onto the end of it, but I'm not sure what else I'm supposed to do here. Okay guys, it looks like the maintenance has ended, so here is what I actually wanted to show you guys, especially if you're running the device uh, such as an iPad, an Android tablet. So guys, what we want to do is go into controls, customize your control settings, and as you can see I've kept it at default because I play this game on my mobile a lot and not on the tablet, but what you want to do guys is just shrink the size of this for your tablet. So, there you go. 
and that will then make it easier to actually do the dash the dash boost thing in game. Remember it's only forwards, it doesn't do any other directions, which I think the developers should change, they should make it so it dashes in any direction, which would make strafing and dodging shots much easier. All right guys, well, I think that's about it for this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I will be putting out a lot more soon, so make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next video, guys. Peace out.